Just what killed off most of the world's megafauna during the last stages of the Ice Age? It's the world's oldest forensic cold case, and for many scientists, humanity's fingerprints are all over it. Imagine a world in which wombats were the size of cows. Kangaroos stood two to three metres tall. And marsupial lions weighing over a hundred kilograms were roaming about looking for their next bite to eat. In the Americas, there were giant beavers, up to five species of wild horse, giant sloths, and very nasty sabre-toothed cats, such as the aptly named Smilodon, with its enormous canine teeth. But during the last phase of the Ice Age, between roughly 50,000 and 10,000 years ago, almost 200 species of mammals went extinct across the globe. That's like the blink of an eye in evolutionary terms. While our species is obviously still here, and remains the chief suspect in this mega murder mystery, our close cousins, the Neanderthals, Denisovans, and probably other relatives also went extinct at this time. So just why did it happen? Did we mean to kill them off, or was it just an accident? Theories abound. Wild fluctuations in climate may have led to the megafauna's food running out at different times. The problem with this is that ancient records of climate change show nothing particularly unusual at this time on a global scale. Another theory is Blitzkrieg. Humans rapidly overhunted the megafauna. This sent them into the abyss of extinction soon after our kind settled new parts of the planet like Australia and the Americas. The megafauna in these places had never seen humans before, so probably didn't recognise us as predators looking for our next meal. The final idea says we humans wiped out the megafauna by accident. Our ancestors began to spread across the planet from our African birthplace around 70,000 years ago because our population grew so quickly. They burned the landscape and introduced exotic species and diseases. The slowly reproducing megafauna simply couldn't keep pace with the demands of the human palate and changes humans wreaked in the environment their populations collapsed. All the while, our human population probably doubled in size at least four times in the 40,000 year window in which most of the megafauna disappeared. That's a heck of a lot of extra mouths to feed. The evidence is stacked against humans. Although my theory is that it wasn't always deliberate with Ice Age climate change aiding and abetting the situation in many places. So what's your theory? Are we making the same mistakes today? What could we do to stop the current extinction crisis?